sagging, bouncing, or uneven floors, standing water or high humidity, nasty odors, or dangerous mold. Crawl space problems don't get better with time, but they do get better when you call APS. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Monday, May 23rd. I'm James Spann. Some beneficial rain for Alabama this week between now and Thursday, and then the rain will be gone in time for the upcoming holiday weekend. So let's talk about it. This is the upper air look this morning. We've got a weakness in the ridge. That thing's been parked over us for a while, keeping us dry through much of May, but that weakness has developed. We have a stall surface boundary to the west, a disturbance that came in from the Gulf, and look at that rain this morning. Pretty widespread for the northern two-thirds of the state. Some heavier storms over parts of southwestern Georgia. Temperatures this morning are mostly in the upper 60s and low 70s. Highs will be in the 78 to 82 degree range today with a lot of clouds around. There's the watch warning map. Pretty quiet across the country this morning. But a chance of severe storms later today for parts of the southeast United States. Mainly east of Alabama and also to the west through parts of Texas and Oklahoma. Uh, that risk in Alabama includes the southeastern counties of the state with the chance of a few strong storms this morning. This is tomorrow, risk of severe storms over Texas and south Oklahoma. And then day three, Wednesday, a risk of severe storms from southeastern Texas up into parts of the Ohio Valley. And that risk on Wednesday includes parts of north and west Alabama. And again, the threat will be from hail and gusty winds. There's no tornado threat this week. Our tornado season for all practical purposes is done. Here's the rain for the next seven days, and of course the bulk of this will be between now and Thursday for us. Rain amounts, additional rain amounts between 1 and 3 inches, and that's good to see. You want to see good soil moisture going into meteorological summer, which is getting awfully close. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 06C run, valid today at 4. Got broad troughing to the west. Again, the ridge is weakened here, and I uh, have a cloudy day with uh, the bulk of the rain probably this morning. This is the high-res NAM ballot today at 3, and you can see that uh, rain we've got this morning exiting the state to the northeast. So a pretty decent chunk of the afternoon will likely be dry, including tonight. This is tomorrow. Uh, surface low is located near Texarkana, Arkansas. Uh, and again, uh, we'll see a few scattered showers, but I think it's, the rain will not be especially widespread tomorrow. The high around 80, the sky will feature more clouds than sun. And then Wednesday, the chance of rain will be increasing again with a surface front approaching from the west and an upper trough as well. And again, there could be a few strong storms involved on Wednesday, especially Wednesday afternoon. The main threat coming from hail and gusty winds. And Thursday looks wet, uh, cloudy with periods of rain, maybe a few thunderstorms, highs in the upper 70s. And uh, could be a pretty good soaking for the state. So between uh, what we have this morning and on through Thursday and Thursday night, a really good chance of some beneficial needed rain for the state. And then Friday, a dry slot works in here. The sky becoming mostly sunny. Could be a very pleasant day. The high at or just over 80. And the holiday weekend looks great. This is Saturday and Sunday. Bright sunshine both days with highs in the 80s. And Monday, Memorial Day, a 588 upper high building in. And again, we are dry. So after a Wet period today through Thursday, the three-day weekend really looking nice. We'll go out 10 days. This is Wednesday of next week, the 1st of June, first day of meteorological summer. How about that? The westerlies up to the north, and that looks quiet, maybe a few spotty showers around. Rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble a lot, and the bulk of that's going to be this week between now and Thursday. The mean here uh, between now and the 7th of June between 4 and 5 inches. Temperatures, you can see 79 today, then 80s tomorrow and Wednesday, upper 70s Thursday and Friday, and then temperatures tick up again, but nothing excessively hot. We'll be close to 90 by the middle of next week. And the latest 8 to 14 day outlook, this is for May 30th through June 5th, below average in the northwest, above average for the eastern states, including the deep south. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog, the next video here by 3 o'clock this afternoon. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Cracks and brick. Cracks and block. Call Alabama Professional Services. Leaning or bowing basement walls. Call APS. Sticking windows or doors. Call APS. Settling or sinking foundation. That's right. 
call APS. It's a fact. Foundation problems don't get better with time, but they do get better when you call APS. Call Alabama Professional Services today.